There is skin dangling off my lip. I think I got it. Nope, sure didn't. Glad you clicked play on a video just about a lady picking skin off her lip. Yeah! Blah, blah, blah. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Answer and Stuff where I take questions from the internet and I answer them. I am not qualified, but I'm doing it anyway. This week I asked you guys what you wanted to know about aliens and this is some of the crap that you came up with. Candace asks, if you had the power to make sure one person on this planet got abducted by aliens, who would that person be? Caillou. Amy wants to know, are you an alien or do you know one? You'll never know if my real name is or if it's not. <laughs> Alice wants to know, what do they eat in their world? Are we friends or competition? And would they be interested in a student foreign exchange program? Programming. That. They eat sphincter skin because of the probing thing. We are faux real friends, so yes. I knew a German foreign exchange student in high school and I kind of feel like he thought that America was some weird planet, not Earth, so yes. Dresden asked, what's the deal with mashed potatoes? So, so many people just stopped this video and they don't even know that I'm saying that they stopped this video, but you know, if you stayed here, <laughs> Amy asks, what do they smell like? Popcorn. Rachel wants to know, can she adopt one? Probably, but I don't think that it's highly recommended because of the whole, I hear they shoot a lot of like mucus out of them, like excrete it just cause. Allison wants to know, why are they illegal? Ah, this is an immigration question. Ben wants to know, how many parsecs does it take you to make an episode of Answer and Stuff? 12, just like the Millennium Falcon. Star Wars nerds, yes. What exactly do they learn from all the anal probes? <laughs> Tina also wants to know, why are their heads so big? Follow-up question, why are their arms and legs so skinny? Second follow-up question, why don't they just topple over? No one actually ever has seen an alien walk. They've always been on like a medical gurney to be like, chopped up. So maybe they're all dead because they fall over because their heads are so big and their bodies are so like frail and skinny. Ever think of that? That it was natural causes? Put that on your autopsy report. <laughs> Wendy wants to know, are they Scientologists? I want to create a religion called Scientology that's focus is to just clear the world of the blue man group. Jenny wants to know, whatever happened to that girl who played Newt? Well, a quick search on Wikipedia tells me she's a 34 year old woman who gives no shits about acting. <laughs> Sammy wants to know, how do you feel about them having bunkers in the ocean? Want to take a trip with me in a submarine to find these suckers? 20,000 leagues of no. Claire wants to know, what really happened in Area 51? If I told you, the government would have to kill you. Lauren wants to know, what happened to Alf? I don't know, but this has very legitimately worried me for decades now. I just, I don't want to get emotional, but I need to be not above that. Al? Valerie wants to know, on a scale of one to Donald Trump, where do you land on the immigration issue? I land on this land is our land, this land is your land. That's where I land, land. Jean wants to know, if aliens broke out my sweet dance moves, would my kids laugh at them too? Yes, we would. <laughs> and Cindy wants to know, Star Wars or Star Trek, your answer determines if we can be friends. You have put a lot of pressure on me answering this correctly. So I will say, uh, I want to make some really clever Star Wars, Star Trek crossover pun joke thing, but I don't want those trolls coming around on this video, if you know what I'm saying. 
So there you go guys, made it through another episode. If you have ideas or suggestions for a future topic, leave them in the comments below and I will do them. Also, don't forget that if you liked this video to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and share it with all of your friends so they can be just as confused as you every freaking Wednesday. If you are new here and you wanna know how this goes, this is it. Every Saturday at noon Pacific time on my Facebook page and on Twitter, I leave the topic for the upcoming week. You respond with a question, then you come back on Wednesday and see if if it made it in the episode and if you subscribe it makes that even freaking easier my calves are burning because i don't know how to fitness <sighs>